The family of Major General Henry Edmund Olufemi Adifope has organized a memorial event and a presentation of his biography to commemorate his life and times. The event was held in Lagos, Ngozika, OHC reports. It's over a decade since General Henry Edmund Olufemi Adifope passed. Major General Adifope served in the Nigerian Army and as a Minister of Foreign Affairs, a member of the International Olympic Committee from 1985 to 2006, and an honorary member of the International Olympic Committee since 2007. And we still believe that we this still event was to celebrate all he was and stood for during his lifetime. Family, friends, colleagues, business associates, and state men were all in attendance. Oludotun Adebola Adifobe Okoji, first daughter of the late general, shared a brief biography of her father. He loved nature and was conscripted by the Lagos Horticultural Society as their president, which position he held for many years until he pleaded to be released. As president, he was able to secure a large, large hectares of land for the society on Lagos Ibadagri Expressway through Governor Raji Rasaki. He, together with his life, loved family, both nuclear and extended. A panel was set up to have a fireside conversation about Major General Adifabe's selfless service and dedication. The legacy that he left behind in the labor movement was that before he became a minister, the first generation of unionists had been trying to have one labor center. In fact, they had the first Nigerian Labor Congress in 1950. The four major unions, you know, ULC, WFU, they've been struggling to form the second one. But General Adefoque put his feet on the ground and brought these four centers together, which produced the Nigerian Labor Congress that we have today. In his acceptance speech in 1967 as the chairman of the National Sports Commission, he vowed to do one thing to develop sport and ensure that every young man and woman that needed to participate in sports and rise from the grassroots level to any level they can get, he was going to do that. The unveiling of the book in his honor was the highlight of the event. So, it's such a privilege and an honor, and I'd be grateful if we would all do it together. Um, okay. So we unveil the book in honor of this legacy of honor, integrity, and selflessness. I want you to support the Adefuefe Foundation by buying several copies and donating to libraries. The Henry and Dorothy Adefuefe Foundation is continuing to support and promote sports and youth development to keep his memories alive. Ngozika Ohai Chesi, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.